After you sign into your Chromebook the first time, you'll want to set up some of the best features so you can use it just a little more conveniently. Let's click the circle in the bottom left hand corner and then click the up arrow above the search bar. From there, these are some of Google's tools that you can use, but I'm looking for one in particular called the Chrome Web Store. So you may have to flip to this second page by clicking that bottom little radio button and then take the Chrome Web Store. Go ahead and select that. Now we're brought to Google's Chrome Web Store. This is where you can shop for extensions or themes that are uh, going to function on the Chromebook. So go ahead and type in, say, Google Classroom. Now something to note is that when you do your search, you'll notice that three things pop up, extensions, themes, and apps. In this case, I'm looking for Google Classroom, the app. So let's toggle over to apps. Now when I find the app that I'm looking for, in this case, Google Classroom, I'll click Add to Chrome on the far right and click Add App. Now from there, let's go back to the circle in the bottom left hand corner and click the up arrow again. Now I'm looking for where did Google Classroom land. Now when I find it, I can either right click on it by tapping two fingers on the trackpad or I can drag it down to the tray. Now let's do that again with Google Drive. This time let's right click on it and click pin to shelf. Right click, pin to shelf. That will pin it down to the shelf. Those are three very common tools that you'll use in school every day. So there you go. That's how you use the Chrome Web Store and begin customizing your Chromebook for productivity.